People of Earth, welcome to Skinwalker Ranch Gaming. This is your friendly Skinwalker, and this is Seven Days to Die, my favorite game, and this is Alpha 19. We are at Horde Night Day 14, and I'm about to test out a base, um, a Horde base that I had been working on in Alpha 18, and um, we're about to see how well it, it holds up uh, for the Alpha 19 uh, version of this game. Um, I think we're pretty much that. I'm kind of rushed. Um, I just got over here, and... Um, and I'm still trying to scramble to get all my shit together. So, um, but basically it's the stair system. I've got three stairs leading up to this, uh, this sort of pathway to me. Uh, so, uh, we should see the zombies. like take one of these series of stairs and, um, and I'll be able to shoot down on them from here. And then once they get up here, um, I will, you know, run over here to my little area and shoot them here. Um, so here we go. Make sure we're loaded. I haven't even had time to do all this. Good God. Alright, that's loaded. Alright, let's see. Here they come. Are they gonna, yep, they're gonna use the, use the stairs. The one thing I wanted to do is take this... Here, this increases range damage, so I'm gonna... Go ahead and... Man, I hate being rushed like this. I'm normally not rushed like this. I usually uh, get to the horde base with several hours of spare just in case. Um, but I wasn't too worried. This I, um, I used this sort of design in Alpha 18. Um, all the way up to, I think, the Day 35 horde. Um, and it just did so well that, you know, I wasn't really worried. Um, about it, so I'm gonna see if I can't put a Molotov down there. That, that was kind of lame. Come on, dude. But yeah, um, yeah, it worked so well that you know I, I didn't rush back. I, I was I was doing some uh, some some quest earlier, so let me switch over to the. Oh, come on, dude. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, so I was out on a fetch quest, and, um, I did that sort of double loot method, and, um, it basically kind of made me a little late, so... Uh, hello. Let's get back to, uh, shooting down on him. So yeah, so far so good. Oh, this looks like an opportunity for a Molotov, if I can get it over there. There we go. Yeah, just line up for me. Come on, baby. Works out good. Oh, nurse. I really didn't get a chance to talk about about my loadout. Um, so so far in game, you know, this is day 14. Um, I've had some pretty good luck, I think. Um, I've been able to find a tier three uh, double barrel shotgun. Um, this AK I actually bought from the trader. Um, the pistol I found uh, was good. Um, let's see what else. I think that's it. And then the basically all the stone stuff I've been able to find. Uh, pretty quickly, which is all the tier six stuff was came pretty quick actually. Um, so this new sort of system of of loot um, has been all right. All right. Let's see. I guess I could be using some arrows, but. I have to waste all the ammo. I get her. Get that done. I want to use the shotgun for this close encounter stuff. Come on, doggy. Come on, doggy. What the heck?
loaded here. Good God, come on. Alright. Loaded. Yeah, they just, um... They, they, the stair system just works so good. Um, you know, I'd like to really um, see how far I can get with it. Um, this this base also, I plan on adding to it. So that's a really other fun thing about um, the design is um, once I start getting a little bit more advanced with, uh, you know, like electricity and stuff like that, um, I want to be able to craft traps and kind of make this like a really like fun like zombie killing machine. And all this right here is concrete, uh, just one layer. Uh, eventually I'll do reinforce, uh, maybe steel. Settle down. But yeah, so far so good. Um, I have the, the uh, zombie level set to, I think, 10 or 12? Um, it's like, it's like one or two up from the normal default. And that's because, um, on day seven, I had a very lame, it was very lame, uh, Horde Knight. Um, oh shit, oh, dang it. Let me take care of that. Of course that would happen. Get over here. Actually. your medicine. I'll get to you in a second. Alright, puppy. Alright. I might try throwing that Molotov again when they line up. going on? Why is it not hitting her? I do kind of want to see what sort of damage they're doing. Let me go ahead and fix that. may just stay right here because the bird has uh, showed up and I, you know, outside of this right here I don't have, let me see if I can't get it. Oh man. Just sit here. I gotcha. There you go. So I hear some beating on something somewhere, so somebody's got something in their mind that, that maybe they've got to find a different way up here. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Ooh, good opportunity for a Molotov. He was already dying. What a waste. Come on, big mama. With your pretty blue dress on. Gotcha. 
Maybe I'll just hang out here. in the booty. Use some arrows. Why use arrows when like shooting is so much fun with the AK or the shotgun? This might be it. Mm-hmm. That worked out awesome. Um, let's see. So early on they did about 500 damage and I was able to repair that. No problem. Everything else is checking out just a See if the, the, the bird did a little damage. Oh, that was probably me shooting. Actually, I don't know. I think I think maybe shooting does cause a little bit. Uh, all right. Do like this. This is kind of my way uh, to get to my area. I did have a ladder system. I didn't like it because it's so high up, and I'm really bad at ladders. Um, especially when they get really high up, um, I tend to uh, fall. <laughs> so um, I kind of decided not to go with that. Um, nice loot here. Uh, but once uh, once I gather up all this loot, I'm gonna I'll, I'll show you kind of the, the design. All right. Yep. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and switch over to fly mode. Uh, exit out of here and then we'll do fly. Okay. All right. So this is the, the, the base. Uh, again, sorry, I, because I got here late, I wasn't able to kind of start off the, um, the episode with this, but this is it. It's basically, um, I don't know if you've ever seen this POI, but it's a, it's a sort of uh, derelict um, like warehouse thing or another. Um, it's got a ton of like debris inside. Um, this debris down there and um, actually over here. Um, you know, I've been, I had to knock out some of that. Uh, but it's it's just a basically a hollowed out brick build brick warehouse, uh, which I really liked because it's it's so big. You know, it's already got that big foundation um, that I'm gonna be able to add on to. Um, so basically, it just starts out with the main stair system leading up, and then I added some two two side stair systems to kind of um, add sort of an additional um, area. So if the zombies start to kind of filter in over here, they can you know hop up this way, and, and the same with the other side. And I just I felt like it would um, kind of thin the herd a little bit, um, you know. And as we saw with the with how they came up, they all they came up all all different sides. Um, so it would be cool probably if I maybe extended this out a little bit so if they were coming in on this side that I could um, kind of shoot down on them early on but you know what's so great about the the block stair system is it takes them a while it's like one hop one hop you know when they and it slows them down uh, which makes it pretty easy to um, to kind of catch them before they get up here um, you know as the hordes grow that it gets a little bit more difficult to kind of um, keep up with them but that's where like as, as I advance in the game, I'm going to add all kinds of traps and stuff with this, so it, it, it will extra slow them down. So as the cords get bigger, um, you know, it's a little bit easier to manage. Um, but yeah, that worked out really good. I'm pretty sure Horde Knight is done. I'll just kind of hang out here and see if any more show up. Let me get back in my little base so I'm not cheating. And um, turn off fly mode. All right. We'll just wait here until it's done. Okay, that's going to do it. So there were no more um, zombies that showed up. Um, so that's the end of this. Um, I'm having so much fun playing Alpha 19. Um, this horde, horde base design worked out great. So I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep adding to it. And uh, so stay tuned for uh, more episodes showcasing this design. Um, we'll see how long it can, it can last. I think it can hang in there pretty good for a while. Uh, so we'll just have to see. So, again, thanks for checking out Skinwalker Ranch Gaming. I am your friendly Skinwalker, and I will check you later.